This is Super Smash Bros. for the Nintendo Wii U. Now I know what you're thinking. It's not exactly retro, Dr. Virtual, what you're playing at. I know, but I'm just, this is like a, a one-off type of video. So I just want to play on this for a bit and uh, yeah, why not? So I'm going to be going eight player smash. Right. Now this eight player smash is only available in offline mode, I'm afraid. So let's start, who shall we be first? Uh, let's be Pac-Man, shall we? Yeah. Uh, we'll pick... We'll go for this level. Alright then, let's have a look at this then, shall we? I'm not particularly great at Smash, but I just I really do like it though. This is how Smash Brothers should have been. It's always been like this though, it feels like, but putting the 8 player Smash into it adds an extra massive flair. So if you've got a lot of mates who have got a Wii U, bring him round your house and there you go. If you've got 7 mates who have a Wii U, there you go. Smash it all about. That sounded wrong a bit. But yeah, who cares, right? So, Pac Man. I like being Pac Man. He's one of my low tier characters. Not many people pick Pac Man, you know, because every time I play online, I'm always seeing other people pick, like Ike, um, Captain Falcon, uh, Little Mac. Um, and Zero Suit Samus, which is nothing wrong with it, incidentally, it's just that it is quite an obvious choice. Is that hardly anyone ever picks Pac-Man. I feel like he's a bit underrated. Like, that's mine, that is mine. Barry Bullet, I like to call him Bullet Bill. I really do love Pac-Man games. I played last game I played of Pac-Man was Miss Pac-Man Maze Madness. I've got a video of it if you'd like to check it out. Just look through my account and you'll find it in my uploads. Sexy. What think you're doing, Pac-Man? Take that. You have some fruit in your face. You've got to love Smash Brothers. I've played it ever since the first one in the N64. Alright, let's have a look who won that one then. Pac-Man! Is that me? Yep, yeah, that's me. That's not bad. Oh, I've got seven KOs. That's, that's pretty cool. Alright, who shall we be next? It's a mystery, who knows? Uh, Dr. Mario. Not. Let's be Mario, shall we? We'll go... We'll dress him up as Waluigi Mario. Yeah, we'll go for the temple level. Why well, not? It's, it's big enough. I've really played Mario games ever since I was little. Oh, we've got Duck Hunt in it. Shoot that dog. No one liked you, Duck Hunt. Yeah, apparently a lot of people found that game annoying. Yeah. I love Super Mario 64, that game for the N64 is just groundbreaking, even still to this day. Absolutely fantastic, you cannot beat the old classics. Take that Ness, I bullet build you right in the face. What are you going to do about it, huh? What are you going to do about it? Yeah, that's what I thought. You're going to do nothing. You've knocked the coins out of your senses, mate. Have some of that. 
I don't get why Sonic's here. I keep on. I, I'm not really too bothered either. If he's in the game, he's in the game. Moaning ain't gonna change it. How often do companies listen to the fans anyway? Gaming companies. That's mine. I don't get the reason why they left Charizard in as well. They should have brought back the Pokemon trainer. If you don't, Charizard wasn't exactly the main choice either. It was either Squirtle or Bulbasaur. Many people preferred that anyway. Get away from me. I like this level at least anyway, it's nice and big and spacious. Very ideal for brawling. Yeah, I just taunted. What are you gonna do about it? Are you kidding? And I came second. Look at that teeth, man, that dog's smiling with them big teeth. Oh, I've got one KO at least. And you got three KO stuck on Jura, that's not bad, that's not bad at all. Another eight player smash. We'll make this the last round. Um, who shall I pick? I'll, I'll be Little Mac. And we'll pick Bridge of Elden from one of the uh, Zelda games. Fox made his debut in 1993 in the SNES game Star Wing. That's what it said on the screen just then. I love Star Wing, that game's amazing. Flying through space, I just love space games. I'm a sci fi fan anyway, so it's only natural. Or then you went into Lilac Wars, 64, which is what the Americans call Star Fox 64. But me personally, I prefer the title Lilac Wars, it sounds more original than Star Fox. That sounds too melodramatic, should I say. Doesn't sound as creative. Sounds quite boring. Ooh, punch Pikachu right in the stomach. Have some of that. Lil Mac's quite a powerful, fast character. He's got some hard punches on him. His only weakness is if he goes off the edge, he only has little... He doesn't have good recovery like many of the other characters do. Ooh! Onage! That's what you call Onage. That's mine. And it's Samurai Goro from F-Zero. Sweet. I can't wait for the next Smash game if they're, if they're going to bring one out after this. Hope they do, that'll be excellent. Nintendo, you've done a really good job producing this game. A lot of the other fans were growing tired and restless about when the next Smash coming out. Obviously we had Brawl back in 2000 and something. Seven was it? I can't remember, it was ages ago but still. Brawl was pretty good. I enjoyed the rule. And that's that. Oh, little Mac! Right, I'm gonna leave, leave it there. Ooh, 10 KOs. Not bad, not bad. I'm gonna leave it there, my fellow video gaming minions. Thank you very much for watching. I know it's not exactly retro, but I want to make this like, you know, a one-off special or, you know, I might do an online one video of this. Well, it depends, or this might be the only one. I'll see how it goes. Hey, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you later. May Retro Gaming live on.